Why is your Shopify store not getting sales and how can you fix that? Let's find out. Hey everyone, my name is Eddie and in this video I will review a few stores made by some of my YouTube subscribers and the members of my Discord community. I will tell you everything that you've done right and everything that you've done wrong so you can improve and uh, get more sales, increase your conversion rate. So let's start. This is one of my stores currently at $5,000 plus dollars in sales today. So I will be speaking from experience for everybody not believing that this is real. I will load up the dashboard right now. This store has been uh, running on autopilot pretty much, very consistent. In fact, yesterday did about the same uh let's see in the last seven days it's been pretty consistent same in the last let's do 30 days it's been pretty consistent even in the last 90 days it's been pretty consistent so this is one of the stores that i run and uh, i'll be using the experience i've gained uh, from running multiple successful Shopify stores to give you some advice on how you could improve your own store. So let's start. In case you're wondering, all the stores from this video have been uh, posted in uh, Mavenport, my Discord community. I will uh, leave a link in the description of this video for you to join as well. I definitely help all the members in here and I'm pretty active. So uh, let's start with this store called Cart, the outlet. So the first thing that you've done wrong on this store is you have a logo of a sale tag with a cart on it the store name also has the word cart in it you never want to do that that's not a trustworthy store people wouldn't trust a store that's called cart or shop or trend or uh, deals or stuff like that you want to give it a brand name when people land on your store you don't want them to think that they're being sold to you want them to feel like they're part of a community part of a brand that they resonate with they'll never resonate with oh there's a sale right here buy my product that's not gonna work i assume this is the product that you're selling on the store straight away this is a bit of a long title i would say make this a little smaller call it like a migraine relief cap or something like that this is a little too long especially on mobile which is where most of your customers are coming from this takes four lines way too much so uh, decrease the size of the text and make it shorter as well in here you say in stock ready to ship this is just a waste of space it's important that you take advantage of all the space that you got because people are not going to be scrolling on your website for too long replace this with a benefit and that will make it convert a little better the fact that you put free shipping in here and free returns that's really good that's a good uh, general benefit that people want to see another thing that you've done wrong is your add to carbon is white on a white background you need to make it more visible then it's good that you're transparent with your shipping time but i suggest that you keep it uh yeah look right here at the end you don't want to put it in two places uh, that's not necessary at all here you wrote this on a nice blue background making it look like these are benefits you just want to probably put this on a more of a red background saying it helps with and then tension stress and whatever features and benefits these should be just all one section like you say relieve headaches and then you can start talking about this uh, drug free composition and how it helps and stuff like that these should not be separate it's too much for the customer to read here it's good that you got a gif that's uh, pretty important for customers to kind of see how you use this it's kind of short though and then this is quite a bit of text here without any kind of illustrations any kind of images so you want to kind of uh, you know sprinkle some uh, visual content in here as well it's good that you got a guarantee that always helps with conversions and uh, returns policy very good that you got that on the page ask a question not really you don't really want them to do anything else other than buy your stuff and also get rid of uh, share tweet pin it. those never help they're useless just a waste of space as well and you need more reviews these reviews are not really good fast to mexico no one shops from mexico <laughs> no one's gonna come to your store from mexico and buy from facebook ads uh, so definitely get rid of that just uh, edit them to come from the united states and uh, say stuff like oh it really helped with my headache now i can work a lot better so that's it for the first store now let's look at aqua speaker magic like you've never heard uh, let's see the product page because that's where people will go the home page not that important limited edition aqua speakers so first of all why are they called aqua speakers when they have absolutely nothing to do with water that would confuse customers they'll be thinking that they use this under water or something so that's not a good name at all unless the product does have to do with water and i just don't know but i don't think so secondly it costs zero dollars so i might as well just buy one for myself right now if it's free <laughs> uh you definitely got to do something about that the variants just call it space black 
uh, no brackets, no caps, no need for all that. Call it silver. Uh, don't need to complicate things. The add to car button, again, it's white on white. I mean, every, you, you need to understand. You want people to get on this website and the first thing they see is the product, a little benefit or something right here like the other store had. And then an add to car button that stands out so people can just click on it straight away. Sale timers, I haven't used those in four years. They're completely unnecessary, just a waste of space in my opinion. Ask a question, again, unnecessary. Get rid of that. These three things, unnecessary. Here, it's good that you started explaining things and you also have um, images. However, I don't think you're explaining how it actually works. Like you're saying, it's got good volume, uh, louder than whatever, but people won't know how it works. I mean, I think the benefit of this is that it turns any surface into a speaker from what I know. I don't sell this product, I have nothing to do with it, but I don't think you're telling people why this is special. You're saying it's louder and whatever, no one cares about that. The special thing about it is, from what I can kind of tell from these images, that you, is that you put it on surfaces and it uses vibration, I guess, to make sound. Not too sure, but again, customers will get confused and just leave this website and they'll never come back. So you need to improve on that. And other than that, you don't need to have this in the middle of the description. They're already here. Why do you want them to click on this and they just go back to the beginning? That's not helpful. This is just a waste of space and just causes friction. Turn anything hollow into... Okay, so finally here, after they had to scroll forever, they start to understand. So this is one of the first things that you explain how everything can be turned into a speaker and everything can play music for you, you know, something like that. You got to put that at the beginning. And then some guarantee right here. That's okay. But like, you're not really saying 14 days, 30 days refund policy. You need to explain that a little better. People won't know what your guarantee is. So definitely the store would not convert any customers in my opinion. Let's move on to the next point or fly. So seen this thing pretty much everywhere i wouldn't really try to sell it right now but i can still judge your store and here it is again the same mistake every single store has got the same problem white add to car button on a white background it's just not helping i mean you want people to find it really easy to just click on that add to car button you want it to be as attractive as possible free worldwide shipping good this useless you need to change this this is never going to help you that it's in stock everybody knows it's in stock that's why it's here that's why you're advertising it on facebook that's not a benefit you need to make this into a little benefit of the product i don't know what that could be i haven't researched this product but you know whatever it is the customers love about this you can find more about uh, what customers like about those products when you just look them up on amazon look at the good reviews other than that it's good that you got a little gif here in that messy room <laughs> i'll probably find something better to show customers how it works and then here you say the infrared obstacle avoidance drone controlled with the palm of your hand feel the fun that is a terrible long title that means absolutely nothing you need to strike them straight in the face with the benefits something that uh the main the main uh, selling point of your product and then start explaining and then you go on here and you show a ton of the same picture pretty much. I mean, just different backgrounds. No one cares to see. Everybody knows what this looks like. It's here. You don't need to keep showing it. You need to show videos of how it works in certain scenarios, you know, and uh, why it's so fun. Low power protection. Yeah, you can talk about how it's safe because it lands on its own if it's got low battery. That's good. I would just word it a little better. Obstacle avoidance. That's a good point. And then you have reviews next to reviews. So there's no point to have reviews and then under that more reviews. Just if you want to use this, just use one here somewhere under the first paragraph. And again, these just get rid of them. They never help. And then your reviews, they have no pictures and they don't really say anything. This is the product works normally and has achieved expected effect. <laughs> <laughs> that is how's that going to convince anyone you got to edit those reviews and add some pictures and some relevant text performance may be different planet is also very good earth why is the planet <laughs> the planet is also very good speed is fast good quality so these are some awful reviews you need to change these also make them cards you can make them show as multiple cards and they'll cover less space and you'll get more content in the same amount of space basically so you definitely have a lot to work on this this would not convert right now all right car sable this logo absolutely everybody uses it any store that has to do with cars has this exact thing 
that's not original at all but let's click shop now see what's going on as usual i'm ignoring the home page pretty much because most of the customers won't get there um easy clean foam tf <laughs> Okay, 400 millimeters, some reviews in here. So this is looking a little messy, to be honest. All of the new free themes can do all this a lot better. But anyway, this will not really deter customers, to be honest with you. Expected delivery 10, 15 days. That will sound like a little much. Just make it 7, 15, for example, 8, 15. Restore your car's life. That doesn't mean anything. It sounds like you're just repairing the engine, but obviously this is just a cleaner, free, fast, safe shipping. Well, obviously not too fast, 10, 15 business days. <laughs> and then this is a good benefit to have. Terrible anxiety due to your grubby car. Um, Yeah, I would definitely change this to something better, like keep your car germ-free, cl uh, clutter-free as well, something like that, and then start explaining how it works and why it's special. Uh, you say newest solution, but you don't cure terrible anxiety oh my god how could this cure anxiety so straight away this looks super sketchy i would not buy from this website Chris self-esteem oh my god i'm just gonna spray some foam in my car and all of a sudden i'm gonna be full of confidence and self-esteem it's not this is not good marketing to be honest you you can just talk about how tidy and nice smelling your car will be germ free in which case you will breathe cleaner air those are the angles that you should use for this. You can't just say that you have no anxiety anymore because you have this foam <laughs> that you clean your car with. That's not how it works. That was, that's a massive red flag for customers. Then these are good, to be honest. 96 chose to purchase two or more. Of course, fake stats, but yeah, they help. Self-confidence again. So this is hella sketchy. I will not use that. High quality. This is, uh, you're pushing it maybe too far here as well. And then you got some reviews with pictures. Definitely your customer didn't buy this many. <laughs> Just show pictures like this is simple. Just go on Google, type clean backseat or something like that. Super clean backseat. And then uh, say before and after or something and just post those as reviews. So the reviews are not too bad. But yeah, there's a lot to improve on here. I don't see how anyone would buy this. So it might feel like I'm being a little rough with those stores. But to be completely honest, I'm just trying to teach you how to do better because you will not be making money with these stores that's guaranteed so uh, please take this criticism in a constructive way and just improve your stores and improve the way that you approach uh, all these marketing angles and uh, that will help you convert customers a lot better now this is the last store i'll be looking at it's called lampis flame <laughs> all right let's shop now so first of all it's 35 dollars if we look this product up on aliexpress it costs like 18 19 most likely 20 something with shipping so that means that you only have like 10 to 15 dollars to spare to acquire customers that's never going to happen on facebook you need to mark up your prices 3x the cost of the goods so that in this case would be i don't know 60 something this product would not sell for 60 something i would not sell this on facebook there's more like a tiktok type of thing and even then probably about 40 dollars i would say uh, if you do tiktok organic i guess you can give up like 30% margin because you don't need to pay to acquire customers. Same problem as the other stores. This add to car button, I can't even see it, to be honest. White on a white background. This is bad. Buy now is okay, I guess. You can see that, but then this is just completely useless. What is it? A humidifier that diffuses. It's not good wording at all. It's time to seek out your inner oasis and immerse yourself in your cozy pocket-sized fireplace. Kind of long, kind of doesn't mean much. Here you can talk about how it clears your sinuses, your nose, your breathing. It helps you relax and focus on your work. It helps you sleep and all that. It's good buying something. So this is a good one. But other than that, you haven't really sold it much. You don't say much about it. Like this doesn't actually mean something. This sounds cool, I guess. This is not convincing. This will not convince customers to buy this. You just need to talk about the benefits, which are clean air, helps you focus and helps you work, be more productive, sleep and rest better. You know, I mean, you have some of that here, but you got to focus on these benefits. This, you will never ever be able to be profitable with this price point and this product page it's not gonna happen it's absolutely not gonna happen if you wanted to do facebook ads not only would i just increase the price point but actually i would just i would not even try to sell this on facebook this is this is not gonna work on facebook to be honest unless you do an incredible job but then why would you put yourself in the position where you would need to do an incredible job to sell something just find the product that sells better and then also do a better job with marketing as well this wouldn't work let's also do this dog store really quick let's see what this looks like so this looks okay so far thank you for your purchase what i didn't buy anything enable advanced features and increase okay so see 
as soon as the customer sees this they're out they're not gonna buy anything for your store this looks hella sketchy so get rid of that let's click shop now see what you sell so I don't really know which product you're okay this is showing up on every go away maybe you're selling this I'm not sure you should get rid of tax included shipping calculator checkouts completely useless add to cart button is white again oh my god it looks like every single person creates a white add to cart button you need to get rid of that just you don't need any of this just have one add to cart button that stands out has a good color that stands out your colors are all over the place as well this is just light blue this is green and yellow this is dark blue gray just a lot of inconsistency here and then here if you want to do bundles and uh, upsells and stuff like that just remove this remove this as well just create more variants and call them um, I guess this is a pack right like you get two in one just go in one pack and then make another variant that's uh, s slightly less expensive than 2x the price and call it two pack not the wrapper of course and then uh, three pack four pack just have multiple variants here and just upsell like that that's gonna take way less space you gotta take advantage of all the space because customers are just gonna get out of your store after they scroll twice if they're not interested and then you have all these uh, general benefits showing but you haven't convinced the customer to buy this yet like why would they scroll here and be like oh I'll buy it because they have no idea how this works you'll need to convince them first you need to have a description before all these worldwide shipping or whatever this has nothing under it as well so don't even think run ads on this store because it will absolutely never work this is not a description these are just random bullet points no one will read this just a block of text definitely watch my video where I explain how to create a store and how to do the market how to find marketing angles and how to write a product description it's one of my recent videos I'll put a card on the screen for it you need to watch that and learn how to make a product page because this is not going to work All right, so I'm hoping that helped you understand what went wrong with these stores and how to avoid making all these mistakes. If you have any questions about what I said, just uh, leave them in the comments. I get back to every single comment. And again, Mavenport is uh, my Discord community. It's entirely free right now. 1,100 plus members and I'm uh, very active here. I help everybody with their dropshipping or e-commerce questions, Facebook ads questions. Definitely join this. I'll leave a link in the description of the video uh, to invite you into the server and we'll uh, continue communicating there if you have any questions. I hope you enjoyed this video. See you in the next one.